In the past months, we have conducted intensive testing of a range of free programs and then made useful suggestions to our viewers. After releasing our video highlighting the top websites, we received numerous requests from people asking us to do a similar review about software programs. Now I'm going to show you five of the most useful free software programs that are available for Windows, Mac, and Linux. So without further delay, let's begin this journey. Audacity is a well-known free and open source audio editor and recorder. It's used by many professionals, including those that produce podcasts, and it's also easy to use for beginners. In addition to the standard recording and editing options, it features multi-track mixing with sample rates up to 96 kHz with 32 bits per sample, and plugins can be added to enhance its functionality. Don't let its outdated interface for you. Still a powerful program. You'll find the primary tools here at the top to edit your audio. Next up, BleachBit is the absolute best open source cleaner you can get to free up disk space and optimize your system. While you could do most of this on your own manually, do yourself a favor and just run this program to save your time and possible headaches. It's feature-packed to help your computer run more smoothly and to maintain your privacy. It deletes cookies, deletes logs, removes temporary files and clears cache and internet history. In addition, it also cleans dozens of programs including Google Chrome, Firefox, Skype, VLC Media Player, and many others. Prior to running BleachBit or any other system cleaner, it's best practice to back up your system. You'll notice when you open the program, there are two panes. If you click on any category in the left pane, it will show you a description in the right pane. What happens if you select any item in that category? Don't check any option you don't fully understand what it does. If you select an option that might take a long time or delete passwords that are stored, you'll get a warning. It's your choice. You can either select OK to carry on or select Cancel to uncheck that option. Up next is the Brave Web Browser, based on Chromium. It's free and open source and great for those of you that are focused on privacy. By default, Brave blocks website trackers along with advertising-related tracking scripts and resources using various filters including those from the uBlock Origin project. The Tor function is also built in to prevent sites from knowing your IP address and allows you to browse the net with the protections of the Tor network. When you open a new tab in Brave, you'll see their dashboard in the upper left. It'll show you stats about your browsing along with the websites you visit most often. Over here on the right, they have cards, which would be of interest to those of you enrolled in the rewards program or interested in cryptocurrency. You can modify the dashboard by selecting Customize in the lower right. To the right of Customize, let's go into Settings and then left pane select Shields. Here you can modify the settings for blocking ads, trackers, scripts and cookies. And in the section below it, you can choose whether to allow or block Google login buttons on third-party sites or embedded posts from Facebook, Twitter and LinkedIn. Now for a quick one, Darktable is a free and open source photography workflow application and Rob developer. This program allows you to develop and enhance raw images. This is done non-destructively. Your original image is never modified. You can also manage your digital negatives in a database by using different metadata attributes. DaVinci Resolve is often mentioned as being one of the best free video editors. With a ton of professional features, the learning curve is high but worth it once you learn how to use it. It includes multi-track timeline editing, various trimming tools, along with cool effects and transitions to make your project stand out. Also included are fusion effects to create film quality visual effects and motion graphics. Thanks for watching. Links are in the description. If this video is useful for you, give it a thumbs up. Let us know about it what your tea hots are in the comments. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe and ring the bell to stay up to date with our latest talk and other tech-related stuff here on Zane's Tech.